want to welcome you guys back to Griffin's Industrial Welding School. Again, my name is Mr. Griffin. Today we're going to go over some more of those frequently asked questions that you guys had about the welding industry and some of the different processes. Uh, so I have a list I printed out. Last time we went over the difference between TIG, MIG, and stick welding. Uh, today's question is what is the proper procedure for cleaning the base metal whenever you're using carbon steel? Okay, so we're going to break that question down today. Um, whenever you're cleaning the base metal, let's say you're doing a groove, okay? I have uh, some carbon steel that one of my students cut. Normally when you uh, bevel it, you want to bevel it at a 37 and a half degree angle. This one is a little tight, it's more about a 34 degree angle. But the first thing you want to do is you want to grind off all the mill scale. All this gray stuff right here is called mill scale. Okay, you want to get that real shiny gray. So you want to take your grinder, angle it, and grind everything real shiny gray. Then you're going to do what we call a landing. Okay, a landing is also known as a root face dimension. Landing is like a line that goes right here at the bottom. It kind of helps prevent you from getting excessive reinforcement. Okay, on your weld, and your landing cannot be more than an eighth of an inch. It can't be bigger than an eighth of an inch. So the way that you would know if it's bigger than an eighth of an inch is you take a one eighth rod, such as like a 7018. Once you get it prepped up, you take that rod and you will put it right on the edge. And that will tell you if it was bigger than an eighth of an inch. Okay. So this piece is another piece that we that was prepped by a student. So he's not done prepping it, but you see how it's cleaned up. It's real nice and shiny gray. He's in the process of putting his landing. You see how it's a line right here on the bottom? That's his landing. He's not done with it, but he's in the process of doing the landing. Now you take a 1 8 rod, which is a 7018, and you see how it's not bigger than an eight. This is the quickest, easiest way for you to check if your metal, if the landing is bigger than an eighth of an inch. So you always want to make sure you have a proper landing. But this is the easiest way to clean the base metal if you're doing a groove with carbon steel. Remember, if you have any other questions, uh, be sure to comment below and we'll make a video out of your question. We might even give you a shout out, okay? Um, and if you're ever on the fence on if you want to learn welding or learn a trade, just remember here at Griffin's Industrial Welding School, we're more than just an educational facility. It's a lifestyle.